Hey everybody, what's going on? Snipe you out 561 here, and today we're going to be talking about the PvP meta for Dark Souls 3. Um, there's a lot of upsetting things going on right now in the meta with the community. Um, I'm big on playing fair and the rules that have always been applied. All that kind of stuff. Um, something that I'm personally big on is not using the stun locking weapons that everyone else is using. Uh, the S stock and Dark Wraith Sword are two of the biggest examples of this. And I've seen a lot of it, which is upsetting to me knowing that people think that because you can kill someone in PvP makes you good at PvP, which is not not good at all. You can see here I joined a fight club and I just started playing to see, you know, feeling out the people that I was playing against and everyone is, you know, I mean, neither of these dudes did anything wrong per se, but I would consider myself an experienced Dark Souls player, but this, I don't know if it's in this showcase exactly of people um, using those two weapons, but as far as meta goes, if you're watching this for tips on PvP, don't use the stuff everybody else is using, like Earl Burrows. He's a cool guy. I mean, I don't know him personally, but, you know, if he's showcasing something as a troll, that doesn't mean everybody needs to be using that right now, and that's what needs to become the meta. Just showing something that's a little overpowered. Um, for example, he just did a video with Sunlight Blade where they ganked on an Anne Orlando, which is funny, but don't do that. It was a joke he was doing with his friend. Uh, that doesn't mean summon a bunch of people into a gank, or, you know, play like you've never played Dark Souls before. It's upsetting to see how the community reacts to these dudes who have been playing forever, and it's just weird seeing how the community is evolving for the negative instead of the positive. Which, especially right now, if you're new, don't heal. That guy just healed. <clears throat> you can see that he's doing almost no damage to me at all. Which is upsetting that, you know, people aren't upgrading their weapons. People are playing like they would in PvE, when PvP is a whole nother animal. You're playing against people who know what they're doing not an AI. So don't heal in PvP. It's very disrespectful. This is PvP I'm talking about, not invasions. If you're invading someone or you get invaded, no holds barred. Do whatever you can to survive, that's the point of it. But if you summon people, please play with respect to the person that you summoned. Healing just drags on the fight longer. You're not doing this for soul farming at all. <clears throat> so. If the match is only over in 30 seconds and you die, then big whoop. No time lost <coughs> on seeing how long you could drag out a fight. But please guys, try not to use stun locking weapons. Please don't heal. And just keep an eye on everybody. You're your own person. And play fair. Play like you would want to be played against. Alright guys, take it easy.